So welcome back everybody for the second game for today. And it's gonna be Cameroon against Guinea. In this one. After the Ivory Coast played against Mali earlier today. That game is on our channel as well. Make sure to watch it. But in this one. Cameroon will be hoping to get their second victory in the tournament after match day number one. Now let's have a look at both lineups. First of all, it is the lineup for Cameroon. 4 1 2 3 formation with Eto, Chopomoting, and Mokanjo up top. Bia, Eno, and Alex Song will play in the middle of the park. Guinea will be playing with a 4 2 2 2 formation with Sise and Las up top. Balde and Traore will be on both wings with Constant and Conte in the middle of the park so everything is ready and here is the referee's whistle to start the game also remember to visit our website for the latest results and fixtures of this tournament link of the website is in the description down below Cameroon will be playing with green shirts attacking from left to right Here is Balde now for Guinea. Pass over the top for Cisse, but it was cut out. Now here is Samuel Eto. Still going Samuel Eto. Trying the shot, it was blocked. Not a bad attempt, and Pogba clears the ball away. Here is Nyom. Towards Mbia. Trying to find Mokanjo down the right, but it was cut out. Here is Cisse. Constant Traore Plus Is it for Paye on the overlapping run down the left wing Slides it through for Traore He's in the box now Traore can go for a shot Here is the shot and it's 1-0 1-0 for Guinea against Cameroon And it is Traore Who scores the opener It's his first goal in the tournament but that was a fantastic run. Paye played it towards him. Went past the defender. And the shot was simply unsavable. So anyway, Guinea are 1-0 up against Cameroon. So it won't be an easy game for Cameroon. Because... Guinea played fantastic against the Ivory Coast and it seems that it will be the same situation here as well here is Las has it through for Cisse, he's one on one with the keeper and what a save what a save by Tanje. That could have been the goal of the tournament, but the goalkeeper from Cameroon did enough. Constant now will get the cross in. Get away. Baudet didn't manage to have a shot on the volley. Here is Chupomoting now on the counter attack for Cameroon. Plays it for Samaweto. Has some support down the right. Plays it back for Chupomoting, but the pass was cut out. And here is Constant. Pogba towards Sanko here is Balde finding last it's back to Balde now on the right gets inside there low cross towards Sisse and Ethan J once again on his place make the save Goes it towards Chupomoting. Here is João Matip towards Neom. Alex Song now. 
and Suikoto. Twenty-five minutes played in Cameroon and showed anything more interesting in that final third. Here is Mbia. Conte is against him. Conte does very well. Dispossess him. Here is Balde. Was last. Lost possession last. And they get it back straight away. Here is Conte. Once again it's last. Here is Cisse. Going forward. Plays it through for last. Has some space. Trying the shot. And Ethan J once again. Shows save hands. And it's still 1 0. After Guinea having a number of shots on goal. Here is Conte now. We have to say that Ethan J is superb so far for Cameroon, although they've shipped one goal. He's still outstanding between the sticks. Now that pass was too long and it's come straight to the goalkeeper. Alex Song towards Mokanjo. That was an awful pass. Cameroon get possession back immediately. Alex Song towards Niom. Bia back to Song. Ansue Koto finds Mbia in the middle. Mukanjo. He can get past Traore. As well to hold possession. Here is Matip. Towards Mbia. Ansue Koto now. And now didn't manage to find his teammate. And here is the referee's whistle to end the first half. As it stands, Cameroon nil, Guinea one. We'll be back in the second half, as always. So we're back in the second half, and one substitution for Cameroon. Sally comes in to replace Mokanjo on the right wing. That pass for Chupomoting was too long. Here is Eno. Four shots on goal for Guinea so far, and only one shot for Cameroon. Balde. Back to Conte. Here is Pogba. Geomatip gets the ball now for Cameroon. Here is Eno back to Song. Matip. Asue Koto now on the left. Back from Polo, Alex Song towards Neom. They're rolling the ball in their own half. They're not trying to attack. And Guinea are comfortable in the in the lead. Not putting up the pressure on Cameroon. Once again, it's back to Alex Song. if Guinea had touched the ball in that second period. Now that pass was too long for Asoe Koto. 
and it's out for a throw in. Guemo comes on for Eno. After 66 minutes played. Here's Ali. Bia finds Eto. Trying the shot for attempt by the captain. As the ball goes miles away. Yatara hasn't been troubled at all in that match. With Cameroon passing the ball around in their own half. Now it seems that they're trying to attack. It is Sali. Again. Now towards Eto in the box. Now Eto tries a shot and Yatara with a save. The rebound from Chupo Moting was blocked. And Guinea are still in the lead. Now the pass for Baude on the right is a good one. He has some space in front of him. Still going on the right wing. Low cross towards his end. Good interception from Joao Matip. Bia is possessed by Sise. Now it's Baude. Over the top for Las. He's in the box. He didn't, he didn't want it to get that ball. I'm, I don't know why. But Nkolu got there first. Alex Song towards Neon. Once again, Alex Song. Seems that Cameroon are delighted with the loss, but I don't think they are. That's where Koto Guemo for Niop. Here is Sali back to Niop. Once again, it's Sali. The pass was cut out. Sise keeps it well. It's a nice pass for Constant, but Nkolo is quicker than him and gets first to the ball to clear the way for a throw in. Sanko throws it for Conte. The cross was blocked. Now Cameron have possession. A couple of substitutions for Guinea as well. One minute of extra time to be played. It is Webo going forward past one of the defenders. He tried the shot, was blocked. Now another shot was blocked. Mbia now in the box. Mbia try a shot and the ball goes wide. And here is the referee's whistle to end the game. And Cameroon lost this one with one goal to nil against Guinea. And Guinea will get the three points from this one. Although Cameron had 63% possession, they managed five shots, which is, I think there were less, but anyway, five shots, three of them on target, and Guinea having four shots for all of them were on target. Man of the match in this one will be Cisse with a 6.5 rating. Also remember to visit our website for the latest results and fixtures of the tournament. And link of the website is in the description down below. So after that stunning loss, Cameroon are down to second. And Guinea are up to first with four points. Cameroon having three points. Mali having three points as well. And sitting on the third place. And Ivory Coast are last in the group with only one point. But that was it for today. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow with some more games from the after Africa Cup of Nations. Hope you really enjoyed this one, give it a like if it didn't and also subscribe to make sure you won't miss a single video on my channel. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow with some more action. Until then, take care.